Did Cibola High School staff know that a brawl was planned between two girls? A brawl that would land one in the hospital and the other in jail. Both sides also played the blame game today as the girl who was arrested went in front of a judge. Here's News 13's Alex Tomlin. Dick Diane, her face tells quite a story, but it's the backstory both sides are telling that's also alarming. Both girls say school officials knew their feud was heading towards violence and didn't do enough to stop them. I could have died. She hit me right in my pacemaker. And Helica Dominguez says she never had a chance. I didn't even get one hit at her, and she saw I wasn't fighting back. She kept hitting me and hitting me. But today, the other girl's parents claim their daughter is the real victim. We're parents that will stand behind her. Um, she's, she's just a, a young girl. I mean, you know, she felt like she was backed into a corner. Ms. Harrison? Their daughter, Victoria Harrison, was in front of a juvenile court judge today, just two days after APD police arrested the 15-year-old sophomore for aggravated battery after a school feud turned into a brawl at a park across the street from the Cibola campus. To release her to her parents, she will be on house arrest. It appears it was self-defense. Her parents say she's been bullied for a month by Angelica Dominguez, but wouldn't say over what. I'm just, I'm in bad shape right now. Dominguez says Harrison and her friends were the aggressors. And her friends were all there. All of them were there cheering her on, and everyone had their phones, and they're recording it, having like the best time watching me get beat up. But both families agree on one thing. Apparently this was reported to people. To the school and, and yeah. to the APS school, um, cops. I thought we squashed this yesterday with the security. The school says a security guard did talk to both girls and told them to cool the bickering or they'd be in trouble. Both sets of parents want answers from the school, but reached out to each other. I feel very bad for the child. Um, it's, it's the whole thing's a nightmare. Okay, well, just so you know, APS officials have said they had no idea about the fight before it happened. Diane? Okay, Alex, police do believe the teens in the crowd took videos of the fight, but cops are not going after any of the witnesses and say they don't need the video to make their case.